From our newsroom in Austin, the Texas legislature wrapped up its fourth special session today, leaving education savings accounts, school safety and election bills on the table. I would have loved for the House to pass some clean school finance bill, whether that's SB2, whether it's SB1 without the voucher, and we tried. But when the governor of this state puts all of his political pressure on lawmakers, to not fund public education. This is the result you get. While lawmakers did pass bills to fund the border wall and criminalize illegal border crossings, the fourth was largely Groundhog Day, which no action on a slew of education bills made worse by Republican infighting. The main disagreement was over Governor Abbott's priority of ESAs, also called school vouchers or school choice. Lieutenant Governor Dan Patrick slammed House Speaker Dade Phelan for what he called failed leadership for the entire session, but specifically because Phelan didn't move on a school safety funding bill, an election bill that could have passed last week. At six days to go, a session is 30 days. That's 20% of the session. What the hell was he doing for six days? He could have called him back on Saturday, called him back on Sunday. He could have done something Friday. He could have called him back Monday. They had time to act today. Speaker Phelan released a lengthy statement touting the priorities Republicans did get accomplished this session. A spokesperson for Governor Greg Abbott said, quote, the fight for school choice will continue until it's won, but did not say if and when a fifth special session will be called.